What's up guys, welcome back to another Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro Duel video. Cybers and the new Cyber slash Cynet support here in the video. Uh, a couple of the cards, a couple of cards that were revealed from the Cybers archetype yesterday, I believe, uh, have already been put on Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro, so let's try them out. Um, before yesterday, I've never played with this deck, so I've never played with, you know, all these new, at least all the Cyber slash Cynet cards, so I, I needed to get used to them, right? And that's why I decided to still try out the couple of cards recently released on Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro, so like Clock Wyvern, uh, the new Fusion card, your Cybers, Clock Dragon, the new fusion card, your Signet Fusion, for example, Signet Optimize, etc. etc. So Again, just getting to use, uh, getting used to these cards, right? And uh, I think a couple of cards uh, still need to be put on Yu-Gi-Oh Pro. I think both uh, monsters that let, that let you link some from hand, I believe, and also a continuous spell as well that I believe lets you search once per turn. Also a fantastic spell, by the way. Uh, but again, still testing things out, right? The build is far from being finalized. Like always, feel free to leave suggestions. Again, my point of the video video here was first of all getting to know these cards their interactions etc and to try out a new fusion card i definitely want to main deck more signed fusions right but the small downside here is your cybers clock dragon your fusion needs your uh, clock wyvern and again searching for now with this support here available is is um, quite low but still the new link monster what is it called the clock spark toy i believe its name is again super Superb card. Upon summon, you can search your Cyanide Fusion, and that's once per turn, by the way. It also can reborn something from your graveyard, but if you use that effect, um, you're limited to Fusion Summons for the rest of the turn. As for the rest, the extra deck definitely needs work. It's super packed. Um, you, you can do so many things with Cybers, right? Ritual based, now fusion based. Uh, I, I definitely want to focus on putting up extra links, so prevent my opponent from using the extra deck, right? But again, 15 cards in your extra deck is super, super tight. So again, like always, feel free to leave suggestions which card I should drop or maybe add, right, to the main deck. Uh, okay, so let's see a couple of example duels with this new support. Okay, uh, first example again, this time going second against Black Wings, that's all good. Uh, again, still one fatal flaw here with this deck. I'm not running any hand traps, so no Veiler, no Ghost Ogre, no Ash Blossom, etc, etc. So going second, I think that's fine, right? The deck has a lot of capabilities of pumping out a field of, you know, multiple um, link monsters, right? And thanks to, uh, you know, your new link monster that lets you search your Cyanide Fusion, you definitely have the option to make somewhat of an easy OTK, since again, uh, your uh, Clock Fusion Dragon is very similar to um, Camera Attack Over Dragon, very similar, but it, it can only attack once, right? But will gain a boost of a thousand attack points for every, um, l well, link uh, monster used, equal to, you know, or the, the, the amount of links uh, it has, right? If that makes sense. Um, anyway, use uh, L-Face. Uh, I was running that in the beginning. It's it's an okay card. You can definitely run that as well. The Continuous Spell gives you the extra normal summon. It's needed currently at 3. Not really sure if I want to keep it at 3, but again, just keep upgrading your stuff. We know the opponent doesn't have a hand trap. We know the Black Whirlwind is in his hands. Is Yeah, is in his hands indeed. So I can just, you know, um, establish multiple Link Monsters on the field and eventually um, you can definitely do that because I th yep, indeed, he has two attack position monsters. No, three. Three attack position monsters. So I can just go over the fusion summon. One attack position monster is enough. So Cyber's Clock Dragon um, is pumped out, is summoned to the field. And, you know, for each link, uh, I can mill like a top card of my deck. And I'm not really sure how many cards I milled, but for every card milled, uh, your fusion monster will gain 1,000 attack points. So, okay, you have the capability of pumping out those link monsters, potentially setting up extra link. And I get with the new support that's not yet released, um, I believe it's from Master Link, you know, the, the, the new... Uh, structure deck it just gives this deck more tools right since now it's it's still a little bit f uh, uh, fragile okay you can pump out those link monsters but uh, getting back that card advantage is definitely not that easy 
Uh, this time going first and Ibli is definitely the option for the main deck. You could stop here but uh, and stop here with that is you know using your um, Cybers monsters next turn to get their effect again. But still, I think you have the option to make up, at least to set up extra link, uh, shut out your opponent from using his extra deck, and here in this situation, that was super crucial, right? Um, okay, Code Talker is on the field, but I believe thanks to the... Oh, these names, the middle one, you know, the the, the guy that's um, or to the right next to Firewall Dragon, not which really, is it Exco Talker, uh, at least prevents your opponent from using one monster zone here in this situation, right? So, um, again, shut down my opponent, not you, it's not let my opponent use his extra monster zone, um, yeah, pretty much shut him down, right? And now I can just easily go for a game. Another example, the opponent gets to start again, again no hand traps but um, that's all good I believe the opponent is going to end with uh, cyber dragon infinity uh, Pleiades as well and one uh, edge blossom so that's three possible negations again quite strong and that's something where this deck uh, struggles right uh, battling against those multiple negations but I'm sure with this new support from I believe again the structure deck the two monsters that let you link summon from your hand and of course a continuous spell that gives you a search I think uh, definitely helps right um, this quick play spell is very similar to a card that black wings have uh, you know tribute and special summon something from the deck Oh, I, I, can't remember, I can't remember the name, but you know which card I mean. But again, uh, thanks to that continuous spell, still having the extra normal summon and just a goal for your spar toy. Get the search of your Synet Fusion. And just keep upgrading your Link stuff, right? Um, going to use Firewall Dragon to balance back one of his monsters. I, I think I'm 1000 life points short to go for a game, one extra link short to go for a game. And the cool thing here is as soon as your Cyber's Clock Dragon is destroyed, uh, for example by your opponent, you can search any spell card from your deck and add it to your hand. So again, you have a couple of options here. Um, I believe at this point I was uh, running two Synet Fusion in the, uh, in the main deck indeed, but um, well yeah, it's just the fact that uh, and, then, and that's something I like here of this new Cybers deck of the new Cybers cards is out of one card you can pretty much have like a comeback, right? Again, uh, getting those draws, getting those searches and keep upgrading your link stuff. That's definitely much more easy or much easier with this new, or at least with the Cybers archetype. So I'm anxiously awaiting when Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro is updating with, you know, the new support, um, the other... Um, Cybers monsters as well. If, if someone knows what's up, yeah, probably when by the time this video is online, it, it might be up. So um, that's something we don't know, right? Uh, so again, summon sorcerers is quite crucial. Again, searching any Cybers monsters from your deck. Uh, most of the time, I, I forgot its name. It's the level one that lets you search level five from the deck. <laughs> All these names. Um, but uh, again, just keep upgrading your link stuff. Uh, it's quite easy to go over the first turn Firewall Dragon with uh, something like Goblin, for example. And then, you know, it's up to you how you want to play it out. Here, I opt not to um, build up my, uh, my, my summon. Uh, further not really sure if I had the option or not really sure if I uh, if I should have done that but now well I, I see he did have Raikiki so I probably wouldn't have mattered that much uh, I'm not playing uh, Cerberus in my extra deck and again sp space is an issue in the extra deck so Again, it's 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 still a bit iffy, you know, with the card choices. So again, like always, feel free to leave feedback. And due to the fact that this deck is not running any hand traps or infinite impermanence, that that should probably be main necked. Um, it definitely would have helped out here in this situation. Now we can just you know establish a couple of monsters and eventually attack for a game. So. Ah, that's a problem, since again, I had enough fuel ready for next turn, right? The Synod Fusion wasn't alive, since again, no Clock uh, Wyvern level 4 in my hand. But, uh... Yeah, things happen, right? So again, the, the, the main deck still needs work. Again, like always, feel free to leave suggestions. The main point here was to try out these new cards and, I can, you know, getting used to these cards, getting feedback, and as soon as the other um, Cybers monsters are released, revealed, or at least released on Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro, I'll definitely uh, pick this one up again. So again, like always, feel free to leave suggestions. The deck definitely needs work. Like the extra deck, um, maybe some card choices in the main deck, 
Um, let's take a look. Uh, yeah, I'm not really sure about um, the, 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 maybe the, the yeah. I think you need to main deck ably, right? Um, but still, the extra deck is is where uh, I need those suggestions. So again, like always, feel free to leave suggestions. The the archetype also has like a continuous trap, at least a con no a, a counter trap that negates stuff. Definitely very very solid. But the main deck space is quite tight, especially with the other cards uh, in my mind as well that I need to main deck. Um, okay, um, guys, that's it. Thanks for watching. Feel free to leave a comment or a like if you enjoyed the video. Leave him signing out. Peace.